So today we're gonna do something a little different. Check this out. Hello friends. So today we're gonna do something a little different. Check this out. We are going to clean two area rugs. Now you're thinking, what the heck? Well, these are from my house. 99% of the time, I'm gonna take these over to the car wash and spray them off. But I have had these for many, many years. And what I wanna do is get them clean using Flex products. Now, you can tell I have a very hairy dog. So, of course, that is going to be a challenge, but we're going to do it. And along with the hairy dog, I have a Shedding cat. Now granted, she's just a short hair. But it's a cat nonetheless. So, we're going to clean these, but we're going to use the Flex products. I want to see if they can do any good on these carpets. I can't even tell you how many times somebody has asked me, how do you use this? I struggled with that myself. The instructions are right here. One scoop of the powder per gallon. So we're going to mix that up now. So I have a gallon of water here. I already put just a pinch of uh, rinseless wash in here. The reason why is because I wanted to kind of soften it. So we're going to put one scoop of the citrus into the gallon. This gallon should never be used for human consumption of anything after this. Just want to make sure I put that out there. I always fill mine just above the writing on here. I don't know how everybody else does it. That's how I do it. Okay, so this is ready. This is all part of your prep work. Have everything ready. Get it set up that way it's going to save you some time you do not want to leave the citrus in your container when you're done with it you got to get rid of it otherwise it's going to mess up your pump and your nozzle and all of that it will just eat it up I purposely did not vacuum these carpets when I was at home cleaning the living room and had this brilliant idea to bring them up here and clean them. So you can tell that I actually do take pretty decent care of them, but they do get a lot of pet hair on them. I'm no different than most people. I get pet hair everywhere too. So you can see the difference. The fibers as I vacuum are coming back up. And I don't know what kind of a difference we're gonna be able to make on these fibers by the time it's all said and done. But I'm gonna do everything that I would do in a car.
Alrighty. Let me show you what showed up on the table. With Flex Citrus, you spray it on evenly and you allow it to dwell for five to 15 minutes. I always shoot for seven minutes. Okay, so let's take a look at the Flex Ice. The Flex Ice is going to neutralize the citrus. So they work together. Now, I have found in the carpet industry after reading that you can use Flex Ice as alone in a spray bottle as a spot remover. And I have done that on some of my videos. It even says on the directions, let me put my glasses on, to be used as the primary cleaning agent or as a rinse agent. So the rinse agent is gonna be with the Flex Citrus. So then let's look at the instructions. So you use one ounce flex ice per five gallons hot water. Mix thoroughly until dissolved for extra heavy soil. Use two ounces per five gallons of hot water. So it gives you the instructions for light soil and heavy soil. I've already put it in a container and when I fill, I'm only going to use a pinch because in the end, we just need enough to neutralize the Flex Citrus. I hope to heaven this comes out in the camera. We have a, a much lighter color here than we do here. This section has not been done yet, only treated. So I hope it comes out. But this is much cleaner than this. I had half a gallon left, so I put half of it in here. looks much cleaner the fibers are not laying down this one definitely looks a lot cleaner I will say this one this big one gets more traffic and it is where the dog lays a majority of the time 
but I think it came out pretty darn good. Now, I did not shoot for perfection to get the animal hair out. Why? Because as soon as these are dry, they're going to go in the house, be put in front of the chairs again, and Bella and Jazzy are going to be going, um, these do not smell like me, and they need to. Except for when I first bought them. They've not ever looked this good. So I'm going to leave them here and let them dry. I have another video I want to do. So I'm going to get started on that. But I'm pleased with the results. The Flex did a great job. But I've not been disappointed with the Flex either. Never. Uh until you understand how to use it it can be a challenge but once you read the, the directions and follow them it works so these are my area rugs and they look good now and thanks for hanging out on my channel for a minute guys i sure do appreciate it if you'll take a minute to hit that like button uh maybe leave me a comment and hit that subscribe button i would love to have you and until the next video, which will be that next one, but I'm not telling you what it is, <laughs> we'll see you later.